Hello, my name is Paras Kivas Monikis, and I'm the producer and participant of the documentary My Dad Spiro. So, what inspired us as a group to make this documentary? Um, well, when I was, when I was 15, um, my dad passed away, and it was probably the most traumatic experience of my entire life. Up until that point, I, I'd never really had a, a serious brush with death, like I never, I'd never had an experience with it to that extent. I wanted to take that experience and I wanted to try and translate it into a film. Um, so what problems, uh, challenges, hurdles and obstacles did we face? Um, there were quite a few. Um, and that being on, on, on set, um, there weren't so many problems, I guess, and challenges. I mean, on, in terms of the technical side of things, I think we were pretty good. We kind of just, we got set up and we started shooting and, you know, I just talk. It was like talking to a therapist, really, like for me. Um, some things that came out of it though, were, you know, we, 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 we found ourselves laughing and joking about a lot of things in between takes. Um, a lot of gallows humor, especially because we were dealing with such a, a traumatic sort of topic. We sort of found that to deal with that, you know, the sadness you know, it was always good to just, you know, make, make jokes out of it and laugh and, and, um, that sort of helped get, get us through it, I think. But a lot of the issues came in the edit and finding the story because uh, with documentaries, of course, a lot of the time it's very much get a whole bunch of footage and you tell the story from the footage. Um, and that's, that's what we did. So that was a little bit difficult and we didn't really have the cut of the film that we had right up until sort of the last, like the final hour, really. But that being said, the response to, to what we had was just phenomenal. Um, when we screened it at my university, um, I had at least 20 odd people come up to me and just tell me how it affected them. Which moving on into the next question is what I want this film to achieve. Well, I think first and foremost, what I, what I, you know, what I want everybody to sort of take from this is that life is very limited. Um, it is, it's very short. And I suppose you should always cherish the ones that you, you love. That's, that's another takeaway. Um, and sort of make the best of the time that you've got really. That's, that's, that's it. And if you've got kids, well, <sighs> do the best you can, really, if you've got kids. Like, that's, that's all I can say, because, uh, you know, and try to be healthy for them, because, you know, if you pass away and they're young, they're going to blame themselves. That's what I did for a long time, and, yeah, that's what I want, you know, people to know, I guess.